welcome to my 12 minute fix, the first one I filmed. You're gonna, it's going to be 12 minutes, the 12 exercises, just, just follow along at home. Each one, I'm going to make it slightly tougher than I said on the first on the website. 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. If you need to do 30 and 30 or even less, not a problem, everyone has, has to start somewhere, do so. So work as much of the minute as you're comfortable doing and then rest the rest of the minute. So, I'm going to put the stopwatch on and we're going to start with the first exercise. It's going to follow along with that start. Okay, the first one is high pull. I'm using a 5k weight, half squat, leave with the elbow. Half squat, leave with the elbow. Stand up like you're, unfortunately, elbowing someone in your face. Bam! Squeeze your bum as you stand up each time. I'll show you from the side. Down, nice strong back. Squeeze. Down. Down. Keep going. Joining you with me. I might have said left, but I meant right arm. Good stuff from the square run. 12 seconds left. Squat. Bam. 12. Bam. Keep going. Squeeze. Bam. You can do this with any exercises. Modify the 12, I'll be putting other ones. I'm going to pause out to the 40 seconds. 20 seconds rest. So I'm going to put other exercises on fitteru.net that you can put into a 12 minute fix program. 11 more to go, 10 seconds more rest. So we're going to do the same thing on the other one. So you can do it anyway. Don't need any space to work out. Standing basically is all you need. Three, two, one, let's go. Down. Squeezing that bum and the legs as you stand each time. Getting warm now. Obviously I'm doing this. I've warmed up already. Uh, I'll, you should always warm up with some dynamic stretches as I take all my clients through each time we meet. Only takes two and a half, three minutes to do so. Warming up the body from the ground up. But it just gives you that chance to mentally and physically prepare for the harder stuff. You see I'm squeezing my legs and my bum as I stand up, making sure everything is rock solid at the top. Three seconds, three, two, one. Rest there. Next one, Renegade Row. I'm going to do it down here first of all. I'm going to be in my hands and toes press up position, alternately lifting the weight. Okay, doing well. Two exercises in, ten to go. Five seconds. Get ready. Here we go. Two, one, go. Bam. Change hands. What I'm doing, keeping my body still and my core still and square, is passing the weight across and lifting with one hand. So try not to rotate too much. Nice and square, just the arm, back and shoulder does the work. Over the halfway mark, keep going. Looking good. Well done. I'll just move around here in case you can see a bit better. There we go. Three seconds. Three, two, one. Well done. Rest there if you're doing the 40. Next one. 15 seconds more rest. Hold the weight in one hand. Maybe this is the one you started with. We're going to do squat and press now. So you're going to do overhead press and a bit of a squat. I'll grab the weight. Three, two, one, let's go. Try and keep the elbow at 90 degrees. Hold and press. Down. Square. Just to activate the biceps as well. Getting a nice squeeze in my bum, thighs. So again, we'll do this for the full 40. I've done this with fives. You can buy a really decent, well these in fact, a pair, a good value pair of dumbbells from Decathlon online or in their stores for £14. That's what, exactly what these are. Bam! Three, two, one. Squeeze, rest. <sighs> we are four in, eight to go. 12 minute fix. Do this once a day, do it three times a week, do two in a row, then two days off. So many different versatile ways of working with it. Change the exercises in it. This is a really good arm. One I really like for fat burning. Three, two, one, let's go left arm. Down, stand up, squeeze, bum, press. Very good. Keep going, nice one. Squeezing the bum in as you stand. Explode up. Punch the sky with the weight as you stand up to it. Excellent. Bam. If you want, punch and go straight down. If you want to get a few more reps in, 
I show from the side, nice strong back. For squatting, bum down, heels back, squeeze and press. Down and squeeze. Three, two, one, awesome. Biceps next. If I have my bicep, my, my bicep, my 5k with me, I might do alternate pumping bicep curls, or I might hold one and do both. As it is to make it tougher, I'm gonna to do 20 seconds one arm, 20 seconds on the other. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Fantastic. Keep going. The time screen is about to go off. Good stuff. With biceps, glue your elbow to your body to make it tougher and really isolate the bicep in there. If you want, you can twist at the bottom to get a bit more range of movement through the bicep. Three, two, one. I'm changing arms halfway through. This is exercise six. After this, just another six. You're halfway through in 10 seconds. Squeeze, squeeze. Well done. Four, three, two, one. One more squeeze. Awesome, guys, you're doing brilliantly. Six more minutes, that's all you're gonna do. One of my favorite slash least favorites next, pulsing lunges. You're gonna take a big step forward, and if you've got a weight, and if you want to add the weight in, all you're gonna do is bounce up and down, so hold it in place. I am gonna add the weight in, so I'm gonna rest it on my front thigh. Let that put a bit more resistance through the exercise. Let's go. So my body is nice and upright, my core is tight. Good for balance as well. Shoulders back. Nice, squeezing up and down. They're all 40 seconds. This one sometimes feels that long, feels that longer. But equally, if 40 seconds is too easy, make it 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. That's the beauty of the 12 minute fix. You can shape it to your needs as and when and how you're feeling. Seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, 20 seconds rest. I'm gonna do the other leg in a second. I'll do a face on so you can see my form again. Um, after that, we've got the uh, screens going off, it's fine. Then I think that now it's good. Seven seconds. Everyone likes these sort of rustic homemade videos. So again, big step forward, go. You may have been surprised to learn this isn't, hasn't been filmed by a professional photographer, but no, it's just me, bit my phone. Okay, same thing again. So I'm resting, I'm not supporting the weight, I'm just resting it on my leg so that the weight of it goes through and is added to this front leg, doing the work. Good. Knee should be nice and uh, almost near to the ground. Keep your front uh, lower leg, so the calf, the uh, fibula, vertically, vertical. 10 seconds. Good stuff. Bent over row next, I'll show you that in a second. It's easy. Two, one, awesome. Bent over row, we've got four left. Break at the waist, stick the bum out, shoulders back, and you're gonna pull the weight into your stomach, really squeezing your shoulder blades together each time. Five seconds. Three, two, one, let's go. Four left. Keep the elbows in tight, brushing past the body as they come in. Equally, you can do this with two weights, and if I was, I'd be holding them like that and twist them in. So many different ways and you can modify it if you need. Careful with your back with this one. Make sure you're sticking the bum out. I don't want to see anyone rounding. That's awful. Bum out. Sexy bum, some people say. Pull it into the stomach. Boom. Good. 12 seconds. Really squeeze the centre of the back together. Squeeze the back together like you don't like it. Oh, yeah. Squeeze. Two, one, fantastic. Three to go. Going back to a bit of big movement all the way through the body. We're gonna do clean and press. So we did the high pull to start off with. We're gonna add in a press. Four separate movements. So it looks like, two, one, down, squat. Back of the shoulder, press, down, down. Four movements, one, two, three, four. Good stuff. Equally, this workout works pretty well with the kettlebell as well, especially with this sort of action. You can swing it round to the back of the wrist, press it down, and from the side. Bam. Nice. 
Good guys, well done. Keep going, stay with me. Let's do 30 seconds, you could have stopped by now. Your rest has started. I've got another three, two, one, rest. 20 seconds, just two left. We could do the other arm, and then finally we'll do overhead triceps. I'll show you that one in just a second. You see, it's just the right level of toughness. Obviously I could go heavier, or I could make do longer work sets, shorter rests. Penultimate one, set 11, let's go. Down, back, press, press, down. Nice. Or if you've got a range of weights, you can just do the weight you feel appropriate for each exercise, going as heavy and safely as possible. Squeeze the bum, bam. Anytime you do a squat and stand up, squeeze the bum, not just when you're exercising, getting off the tube, squeeze your bum. Getting up at work, squeeze your bum. Down, keep going. Good stuff. Six seconds, five, four, three, two, one, awesome. Last one coming up, overhead triceps. I like to hold my, my dumbbell like you're doing a dark shadow puppet. Hold it vertically, like so. Extend the arms overhead, and time. Three, two, one, let's go. Bend the elbows all the way down, and extend. Down, and extend, good. If you can see that all, fantastic. So from the side, squeeze your bum underneath for support and keep the elbows in nice and tight. 